Mm. Fun fact, did you know your tongue print is as unique as your fingerprint? So you know you shouldn't go committing crimes with your tongue. How about less fun facts, more kissing? Hi, Fila. Hey. Felix is waiting for Victor to get back from the wedding. That's why he's here. Okay. Uh, hey, Felix. So, from the way you flung me clear across the room, I'm getting that you don't want them to know. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's just that we've been together for like 10 seconds. I just want to enjoy the fun fooling around thing a little bit longer before we start telling people about us, okay? I guess our unique Tom Prince do have some acquainting to do. Cake sans raisin, sans cake, just frosting. That's how I like it. Mm. Mm. Okay, my parents are in the next room. Could you kiss a little quieter? Alternative solution. Why don't we just tell your parents? Well, yeah, they've been really good to me. They took me in when my mom was going through all that stuff. I just, I don't feel great lying to them. After the first few times you get used to it. Don't you think they'd be happy for us? Can we slow down? I mean, we haven't even gone on a date. We just kissed. Oh, who did you kiss? What? No one. Who did you kiss? I'd be like, come on, I just heard you say you kissed someone. I was reading a text. Honey, it's okay. You can tell me if there's someone special in your life. There's nobody, I promise. Uh, yeah, I, uh, you know, I think I should go. But I don't know when um, uh, Victor's coming home, so that's, um, yeah, that's, I mean, that's the reason why I came here, right? Hey, don't worry, I uh, told your parents that I was helping your dad move back in the day, so now I get to lug heavy boxes up the stairs. Hey, I'm sorry about last night. There's nothing, there's nothing to be sorry about. I ended up talking to Victor. Why don't you tell me your dad's protective of you? Because it's humiliating? I mean, the whole time I've known you, I've been Victor's baby sister, and... I didn't want you to see me as some little girl whose dad watches over her like a hawk. I don't see you that way. Okay, I see you as a super smart, badass, model gorgeous neighbor whose father would murder me if he knew the thoughts running through my head right now. What kind of thoughts? Trust me, we're not there yet. Should we get some drinks or... Or stare at your ex-girlfriend and her new girlfriend? <laughs> no, I, I... Okay, I'm sorry. It's just... Felix, I know it's a lot to get your head around, Lake and Lucy, but that's all this is, right? Yes, yes. 100%, okay? You, you know, um, why don't we uh, go play flip cup, all right? Let's see if you are still attracted to me once you get a taste of my hand-eye coordination. So annoying that my parents are pimping out Victor to some random kid. Meanwhile, my dad treats me like I'm about to be the next story on Dateline. <laughs> wow. You're even worse at fake laughing than Victor. Yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. It's just, you know, this whole my mom dating thing's throwing me for a while. She seems like she's doing a lot better. I know, okay, and I want to believe that she is. The last guy my mom was with was my dad, and when they split, she spiraled hard. I just don't want some random guy undoing all of her progress. Oh. Hi. Hi, uh, you must be feeling. Uh, yes, yes, um, uh, Pilar. Hi. Hi. Stuart. Thank you for meeting us here, you guys. Um, okay, I'm gonna let you guys get to know each other a little bit more, and I'm gonna go get our cakes, and we'll get started. So, um, how did you two meet? I own a meditation studio, and Dawn started taking my energy healing class. Oh, okay. So she must be taking your class for mental health. I assume you guys talked about that, right? We have. Uh, a lot, actually. Um, but who hasn't had a smidge of depression here and there? 
you know, I, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't call it a smidge. <laughs> you know, it almost makes it sound cute. You're right. You're right. I, I guess I was just trying to keep things light. You know what? Let me ask you something. Uh, in this class of um, healing energy, uh, do they teach how to force feed someone toast when they're unwilling to eat, or just to get dressed? I'm gonna take a shower. Felix, stop it. Okay. He's ready to get their cake cut by. <laughs> yeah. It's not fair to your mom, Felix. For you trying to scare him away like that. I know you're coming from a good place, but you're acting like my dad. He's so overprotective and scared of anyone ever trying to hurt me that he doesn't let me live my life. And now I'm forced to hide the best thing that's happened to me and probably forever from him. And it, it feels terrible. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm the best thing that's ever happened to you. Little old me. Second best. That cake in a cup is really good. <laughs> but you have to let your mom live, Felix. Even if you're scared of her getting hurt. And guess what? Things could work out. Are you sure you don't want to stay longer? We don't get that many chances to hang out with both my parents gone. Yeah, I know, but after all the studying we've been doing, I need to do some actual studying. Actual studying? You know, you're a bad influence on me. You love it. I really do. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> Hey, babe, what's up? My parents found out about us. My dad's furious. He wouldn't even let me explain. No, hey, 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 it's okay. Hey, we're, we're in this together, all right? You don't get it. Now he's gonna try to, like, forbid us from being together, but no, I refuse to let him stop me from seeing the guy I love. Uh, wait, uh, you, uh, you, you, you love me? Oh, I, I didn't mean that just slipped out. No, no, hey, Laura, I, I... I love you too. Uh, hey, uh, let's, um, just wait till I get home. Okay, we'll figure this out together. We'll talk to your parents. Okay? Okay. Guys, this is my fault. Okay, and I, I, I want to let you know, I have grounded myself. And so any chore you need me to pick up, nothing's too gross. Felix, shut up. They're on board. Really? Oh, guys, bring it in. Uh, Mama Salazar, Papa. Oh. <laughs> Papa. Uh, okay. Marty, we're cutting this. Can you let go of my hand? Pilar, your parents know about us. Okay, we don't need to hide our love. On top of that, never letting go. I need to get out my keys. Right. Yeah. 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 Mi familia. Pilar, inside. Hey, is everything okay? You go home. Well, well, just... You are not welcome here anymore. I can't believe you. Are you kidding? Hello? Felix, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. I was worried. Are you okay? Over? I'm fine. Over. Okay, yeah, I'm not doing that. Let's just talk like normal people. Okay, um, Pilar, what's going on? My parents found birth control in my room. What? Okay, uh, okay, why do you have birth control if we're not even... Do I not know how sex works? I just wanted to be prepared. I mean, we're in love, and it seemed like things were headed that way. So. Yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, I was, I, yeah, I, I was kind of, yeah, I was, I was definitely having high hopes for that. Uh, I mean, when you're ready, of course. Um, did you explain that to your parents? I mean, not the, you know, heading that way part, but the Felix isn't having sex with their daughter part. I tried to, but they think I'm lying. Yeah, yeah, I get that. What? Whose side are you on? 
Hey, I'm on, I'm on no one's side, okay? I just, I understand why they don't believe you. We lied to them for weeks about us. Hey, uh, you know, would it, um, would it help if we just take a step back for a beat? What do you mean, take a step back? Like, not see each other? I mean, yeah, just for like a, a couple days. You know, until your um, dad cools off. He may never cool off. He's a deeply uncool human being. Okay, look, the only thing I know is that they took me in when I had nowhere else to go. Okay, they're like a second family to me. I, I, can't, I can't mess this up more than we already have. Blur. Blur, are you there? Over? Over. What are you doing? If your parents found out you were here, you could be in serious trouble. What they don't know won't hurt them? What are you doing? I just figured if we're gonna be punished for it, we might as well do it. Do what? <laughs> Exactly. Uh, mm, mm, wait, Plur, wait. Why? Is your mom home? No, 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 no. Um, she's uh, out with Stuart. I just, you know, I'm, I'm not, I'm just not sure about this. Well, maybe I can make you a little more sure. Wow. Uh, yeah, you are beautiful. <laughs> um, Mm. Wait, mm, Flor, just stop. What is your problem? Hey, hey, there's no problem. I just didn't picture this being our first time. I just don't think we should be having sex despite your parents. That's not what this is. I just, I feel you pulling away, and one minute we're taking a step back, the next minute we'll be breaking up. <laughs> you seemed like you were excited about having sex one day, so I thought if we did, I'd just... I just didn't want to lose you. Yeah, no, Pilar, you're not losing me. And I'm so excited. No, 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 no. Hey, Pilar, can we please just talk about this? Pilar. Hey, Pilar, Pilar, hey, hey. Um, look, I know you're pissed. I just, I, th I think we should talk about it. Okay, fine, let's talk. Do you want to be with me or are you still too scared of making my dad angry? To be fair, your dad's already angry. I I'm scared of making him angrier. Goodbye, Felix. Hey. Hey. Are you coming to see me? I just wanted to let you know that my dad and I made up. He apologized and everything. <sighs> okay, oh my god. All right, that is a relief. All right, we can finally get back to being normal. On Pons. Okay, what, what's wrong? It was really easy for you to pick my family over me. No. No, okay, you're wrong. All right, that was not easy. That was brutal. Not brutal enough, I guess. I could have never dropped you like that. I'm sorry, Felix. This is over. Pilar. Can we talk? Let me guess. You're getting back together with Lake. Oh. That that was that was stupid. We were both just feeling lonely. Hey, um, Pilar, I want to apologize. Oh. Okay. Before you guys moved to Creekwood, I didn't have a lot of close friends. 
My mom was in a dark place. My apartment was a wreck. Then you guys showed up. I got you, I got Victor. I got a cozy place where there was always food in the fridge. There were parents I could rely on. When your mom and dad kicked me out of your apartment that day, I realized how much I needed them. So I pulled back. And the ironic thing is not only did I lose them, I lost you. But you deserve a boyfriend who puts you first, always. And I'm really, really sorry that I could not be that guy. So, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's kind of it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see ya. Felix, wait. Where are we going? Hurry up! Come on, hurry up, hurry up! Hi, Felix. Hey, guys, how you doing? Yeah, it's good, good to see you. Okay, let's take this stupid family photo now. One, two, three, Salazar! <laughs>